OK. Declan. <laughs> <laughs> and this is meant to be... John Terry. John Terry. Terry John. <laughs> and this is... <laughs> I am unbelievably excited. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. <laughs> We're at the home of the England football team to set them baking challenges. Even this might be a struggle. This is not to put an apron on. <laughs> I mean, obviously, when you put them on a pitch, there's a little bit of competition. But let's be honest, this is far more intense than anything on a football pitch. You look like you've got nothing on underneath. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, bakers. Welcome to the tent and your very special baking challenge. Now, what we want you to make is your favourite player using gingerbread. OK, the gingerbread should have a nice snap to it, great flavour, and of course, look like the player of your choice. Now, you've got 35 minutes to complete this challenge. If you play for Liverpool, you're probably going to do extremely well. Everybody else, good luck. <laughs> On your marks, get set, bake. How excited are you? I'm more nervous than excited, mate, I'll be honest. I'm um, here with three fathers who do this kind of stuff with the kids. I've baked, like, Rice Krispie cakes and stuff like that. <laughs> Nothing major. Really nervous. More nervous than playing football, this. The challenge we set for the bakers is they have to make a gingerbread in the shape of their favourite football player. Now, there's so many places they can go wrong. They may underbake it. I want the biscuit to snap as a gingerbread should. Is my oven on? It's like Play-Doh. <laughs> I think with the decoration, they've got lots of colours there, so I want to see vibrancy. I want to see the team in the kit. Mate, it's falling apart. What's all that about? They've got to allow time for that. Get the bake done. Allow about five, ten minutes to cool and then slap that fondant on. It's just breaking off. I have absolutely no expectations. How are you doing, Chris? Yeah. Have you ever baked before? I've made a fondant once. What do you mean you've it... made a fondant? Yeah, I made a fondant one time. And it was lovely, you know. It was moist. It never yeah. dried out. It never <laughs> collapsed. Yeah. And it just it oozed out. It was absolutely stunning, you know. Now, who are you doing? I'm going to do Stevie G. Good. <laughs> <laughs> my idol growing up, my England Liverpool idol, so. Yeah, mine. Pay homage. Mine. Yeah, absolutely. Listen, mate, don't worry about this. You've got it yeah, in the back, yeah, right? don't, yeah, don't worry yeah, about this. But the we'll other keep guys. it quiet. Just, yeah, just so the lads. It, don't worry about know, it. Don't miss heart and the lads, so we'll keep no, that right. between us. Agreed. Yeah. Agreed. yeah. Place the cardboard template on the biscuit, though, and carefully cut out the shape of the footballer. What am I cutting in with this? I don't even know which way it's supposed to be used. Look at this. I'm shaking. Come on, man. Give us a break. Just crumbling. How you doing, Dak? Mate, I'm just starting to cut, but it, I don't, don't even know where I'm going, what I'm doing. Oh, looking good over here, I'll be honest. Trent's already cut around his. How has he done that? All right, Jordan. How are you doing, your eyes? I'm concentrating, but... I can see that. I'm not sure it's working. Who are you doing? I'm doing Gaza. Of course you're going to do Gaza. Yeah, I've got the winner. Top player, everyone loved him from the northeast. And that can do like his blonde hair, so hopefully the lads will be able to guess who it is. You really want to beat everybody else, yeah? It's not really everybody, it's just him. You just want to beat him. Your former teammate. Yeah. Have you got any tips for us or not? You're best off actually cutting it on there, then cutting it off. Do you know what I mean? Because then you're not moving it again. So it's better it's... off to put it on there before I cut it. Yeah, I would have done. Yeah, that's a good shout actually. <laughs> <laughs> good luck. It's a bit late now, isn't it? <laughs> Step three, carefully slide the biscuit into the line. Oh, see, this is where I could go wrong. How do I get him up? My favourite player growing up was John Terry. He's a really good friend of mine now, which is obviously crazy, because when I was a kid, he was my idol. Oh, my God, his head. It's falling apart. Ah! Uh, to you. To you, to me. To you, to me, to you, to you. you. And let it down. Look at that Who's that going to be? Wayne Rooney. Wow. I think his head's too small. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say anything. I didn't say <laughs> Bakers, you're halfway through your challenge. Oh, no, I need a bit more time. Trent, you've got hours, mate, don't worry. Oh, dear. <laughs> Stevie G's head doesn't look like that. <laughs> Get it in. We can trim that off later. 
I'm a little bit stressed. Need a good team talk at half-time. You already got it in, Trips? Oh, no. Look at him. John Terry's completely been mauling off. Yeah, that's normal. <laughs> <laughs> no. Hang on. How the hell did you do that? I'm actually fuming. Well, you've got an arm, a ball, a leg, a head. Get it in the oven. Sort it out later with Fondant. What are you doing now? That, um, read your steps and go and no, do I'm just asking what you're doing now. I don't need to know about the steps. What are you doing now? I'm just going to make the icing in there. Right, OK. Is that OK? Can I have a look at your thing? No, you can't. Why? You'll see it when it's out. <laughs> Bakers, you've got ten minutes left. While the biscuit is baking, roll out the fondant on a lightly dusted surface. Not sure if that's lightly dusted. Did you do more than that, Trent? Yeah. Ah, it matters. More the merrier, isn't it, I guess? Yeah, I, I feel like I got this in the bag, you know. So I feel like I'm at the point where I can start helping others. Have you got enough icing sugar there? <laughs> <laughs> you do this at home, you don't you? Hey, Hendo. Just reading it. He's funny, him, isn't he? <laughs> you can't do me like that on camera, can you? That's like his shirt, isn't it? It was obviously a Chelsea shirt. Yeah, he was a Chelsea captain, wasn't he? Well, I've tried to do some shorts. <laughs> some white shorts. I need to get him out. Can I get it out? It's still a bit soft, though. Don't want it to overcook. Don't want it undercooked either, do we? I think it needs to come out now, yeah. It needs to harden up quick, cos that's too soft. Timing's right. He's been putting a bit longer, though. This is getting nice and brown in there. <laughs> it's getting nice and crispy. Bakers, you've got five minutes left. Oh, no, nah, I need a bit more time. <sighs> Cut. Cut it out when it's still warm, just to sharpen it up a bit. It's going to separate me from the rest, cos I know the others aren't going to be doing this. It's going to put me over the edge. Once the biscuit is completely cooled, stick down the shirt and shorts. That's not too bad. If these fit in, by the way, to me... Oh, my God, Trent. Yeah, he looks all right, doesn't he? Stevie V. This is a situation. Come on, John. Gaza, he's blonde, like yellow hair, and then number eight in the middle. Wayne Rooney, yeah. He's got a skinhead, so I don't really need to do much, do I? Clever. Last minute, Bakers. One more minute to go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm rushing here. I'm rushing. Oh, no. He's trying to put his number on. He was number 10, weren't he? I don't want to ruin it. I'm having a nightmare there. Oh, God, this is where it goes wrong. Oh, I've ruined it. I think I've just got it. We're not getting any better than that, are we? Stevie, innit? There he is. The legend. OK, Bakers, that's it. Time's up. <sighs> Bring your bakes up for judging. Put his kit on the wrong way. <laughs> He's got the back of his Has shirt on the front of his body. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll start with this one. Whose is this? Trends. Who's that meant to be again? Stevie G. Stevie G. Yeah, the legend. It's very neat. The shirt is very good. It feels. Look at the robustness. That's well it. baked. Look at the crisp. <laughs> Oh, he's listen oh, to the it's crunch. Burnt. It's burnt. Oh, man, listen to the crunch. It's That's burnt. what you want. It's you want the snap. He just snapped his tooth. It stands up. You want it to stand up. That's really good. OK, moving on. This is yours, Jordan, yeah. Like the smiling face. Ball's good. The Ball's kit good. looks pretty good as well. Thank you. It's a bit rough. He's a bit rough on the edges. How's he taste? It's a bit undercooked, though. Sometimes isn't it? you want it soft as well in some <laughs> no, parts, don't you? <laughs> just sometimes. It can't always be hard. But a decent <laughs> effort. Thank you. Now, moving on to um, <laughs> the Declan. <laughs> and this is meant to be... John Terry. John Terry. Sorry, John. <laughs> and this is... <laughs> How's he taste? It's a little bit underbaked. It's quite Timing soft. reasons. But at least the kit's on. OK, moving on to this last one. Here, Wayne Rooney. Wayne Rooney, yeah. He stands up. Yeah, that's it. does me. stand up. It's a shame there's so much icing on it. It's a little bit soft, but it's a pretty good effort. It's neat. OK, so for me, in last place... Declan. Lost his head good a little effort. bit. It was a little bit good soft. Effort. Thanks, lads. Third place, I'm going to have to go Rooney. 
I'll yeah. take it. Kieran. Oh, is it, your pants have fallen off. It's, your pants have fallen off. <laughs> in second spot, oh. this was quite tricky because this pulls at my heartstrings as well. <laughs> second place. Jordan. Oh, that's <laughs> scandalous. That's actually not a bad biscuit. I was happy with it in the end, to be fair. It's a bit <laughs> soft, a little bit messy, which means <laughs> Trent, Stevie G. Well done, mate. Well done, Trent. <laughs> well done, mate. The winner. Well done, Trent. Well done, Trent. Trent, well done, brilliant lad. Well done, I'm over the moon, I'll be honest. I set myself the challenge trying to win from the start. Go and try them. Yeah, Honestly, try they them. taste amazing. I'd start from that side first, though, I'm honest. I mean, I think I've got a natural talent for it. <laughs> but imagine that in a cup of tea. It's lovely, isn't it? I'm a bit devastated, to be honest. I thought, I thought I'd done enough to win. It pushed me. Yeah. yeah. That's what you want from me, didn't you, Ray? Very, very nervous beforehand, but yeah, really happy with myself, to be honest with you. I'm just happy that the head didn't fall off like Dex. <laughs> it wasn't meant to be. It was not meant to be, but to be honest with you, I actually want to bake. I actually want to try it at home. Hopefully the house don't go up in flames. To come into here and bake is extremely difficult. Big round of applause. You all did a great job.